Welcome everyone. So today I have my little helper here. Say hey. Hey. He's been watching some YouTube uh, and wanted to see dad do some of his stuff. So he's going to sit in today and listen to me. Hopefully not make a crazy person of myself, but you know, <laughs> hey, it happens. But anyway, um, today I wanted to talk about uh, cell phone service again uh, in the terms of actually reevaluating uh, what we currently have. Uh, I know I've talked a lot about different solutions, different uh, MVNOs here recently, but uh, here this past week I was actually talking to a coworker, and they were looking at switching from Verizon to AT&T. And the reason for that is we get a uh, employee discount uh, with AT&T and they're kind of tired of dealing with Verizon and um, from what I hear, you, I can understand that. So to tie in with that, I actually received this uh, this week in the mail, a little flyer here. You can get a multi-line discount on AT&T GoPhone and save up to $600 a year. $600 is a lot of money, isn't it? Mm -hmm. I know, right? Um, so I kind of wanted to dive into that and see if it's really that good of a deal. Um, so... After looking at the discount that we would get through AT&T, um, it really wasn't that great of a deal uh, after all was said and done because it's like a 17% discount, um, for us at least, um, with two lines. It would be, I'm trying to remember, I think it was $80 for 10 gig of data plus $20 per line uh, access fees. So it was $120 um, minus your 17%. It's It was like $103 or something like that. Um, 101, I can't remember exactly. Uh, plus taxes. So it still would have been over $100. And right now with Straight Talk, we're spending $49.27 uh, per line, so multiply that by two, we're spending, you know, $98, uh, something like that. Uh, so we're spending under $100 for two lines. Um, but for uh, this coworker of mine, Straight Talk would probably be a better deal also because they could bring their current Verizon phone over to um, Straight Talk, still use the same towers, still everything is just be cheaper um, price and not have a contract. Um, but with us, I'm thinking about going a different way because that flyer got me to thinking. So let me switch over to this and I'll show you what I'm talking about. All right, so this is the AT&T GoPhone um, website. Uh, right now, I mean, they have a couple of deals. You can get a, like a this one's a free phone, this one's a free phone. Uh, I'll get to those in just a minute. Uh, you can get a 99 cent um, SIM kit for bring your own device. Or if you're the Apple kind of person and do not currently have a compatible phone, you could spend $150 and get an iPhone 5S, which is still a decent phone if you're into the whole Apple thing. So let me jump over here to the shop prepaid plans because that's what we're all here for. Um, not gonna do the individual line because I can cover it in multi-line. Uh, individual line and multi-line both. The only difference is multi-line, you get this right here. The extra dollars off per additional line. Initially, your your first one that you get, you get, save $5 by enrolling in auto pay. So for instance, this one, uh, we don't want eight gig, let's switch to $45. Uh, so we would, uh, this one with the auto pay, it would be $40 a month for four gig of data. AT&T has actually changed it recently to where instead of stopping you at four gig, they actually allow you to continue it as just as a slower speed. Same exact thing that Straight Talk does. Now, with this, you also can add your second line for $40 a month. So you don't have to have a separate account for the second line just to get the $5 off. And if you were to add a third line, 
and go for 45 it's only $35 a month. So you can see how this is going. And then you add the fourth and you can add up to five. So for five lines with four gigs of data a piece, which does include rollover, and I'll get to that in just a second, you'd be paying $170 a month plus applicable fee uh, taxes and fees. So at $170, you would be paying roughly $34 per line if you had five lines. And that is actually not bad, because if you come down here, on the $45 a month plan, it does include the rollover data. And the fine print there is that any data that you don't use of your four gig or eight gig, whichever, will roll over to the next month. But the next month, you have to use all of the four or eight, and then you can start using what you have rolled over. So for me, I typically use two and a half gig per month on my phone. So I would roll over one and a half gig each month. Uh, if there was something that one month, say we're traveling a lot or something, and I could dip it, I could easily use that four gig plus that other one and a half gig. So technically I could have five and a half gig. Uh, and all of these do include unlimited talk and text in the US and unlimited messaging. So that's unlimited texting. Um, to Mexico and Canada and over 100 countries. Um, and then if you wanted to do the $60 a month, that would, un that would include the unlimited talk and text uh, from the US to Mexico and Canada. And you can even travel in those countries with the same thing. But that is not included in the $45 plan. Uh, so with this, you can see that it, it you would, could actually have a very cheap per line, uh, uh, $34 plus taxes uh, if you had five lines. Of course, it's less if you don't have that many lines. But let's look at this. The phones that they have currently, as of this filming, you can get the Galaxy Express 3 free if you purchase $45 in airtime, or you can get the ZTE Maven 2 Go Phone free with $30 purchase and for those that are in, uh, interested in tethering, uh, wireless hotspot or whatever you want to call it, uh, AT&T GoPhone does allow it according to this forum post. Uh, all of their monthly rate plans, 30, 45, and 60 include Wi-Fi hotspot capability or tethering. Uh, your mileage may vary. Um, reading, some people are having problems with it. Some people are, it's working great. So, um, you know, if that is what actually tips you over the edge, then go for it. So there you have it. Um, for my coworker, the straight talk would probably be an awesome deal. Uh, they will save quite a bit of money and not have to buy a new phone. They can continue using their same phone that they've been using. Um, but I think for me and my family, I think we're going to try the Go phone. And that's the beauty of the whole no contract deal is you can try something one month, you don't like it, switch back to the other. Uh, there's, you know, you don't have to deal with a contract. You don't have to be locked in to the same provider for two years or three years or one year, anything. Not just one month and, you know, you're out. So I think that with the $80 between the two, even after taxes, that will be a better deal for us, um, at least to try. So, yeah, just let me know what you think. Um, give it a thumbs up if you like this video. Um, share it with all your friends. Uh, you can find us on Facebook, Google+, Twitter, uh, or our website is frugal.tv. And until next time. And don't forget to subscribe. You heard the boy. Do it.